Well, Slavin, having seen your side take 16 points from the last 18 on offer, is the message from you this week to carry on winning? Yeah, that's our plan, of course. Uh, we are in a good mood, we are in a good run of games. Uh, we are playing good, we are picking up the points, we are, we are doing what we, what we wanted to do. And uh, so it is a plan. Uh, every game is important. Every game was important uh, from from the beginning of the season. Not to mention now, where, where it's like decisive or crucial stage of the season. So yes, yes, yes. Eleven games to go, Slaven. Are performances as important as they were? But I said we're going to take it game by game. So it's not eleven games to go. It's it's. I mean, we know it's eleven games to go, but it's only it's only tomorrow's game. It's it's only the game against uh, against Wigan. That's all it matters. That's all we are focused on. That's all we are, and that is our approach. And that is uh, the best approach, to be fair. Yeah. And they're in a good run of form as well. Yeah. Two of the informed teams in the division. What have you made of their recent success? They are, you know, I have, I want to say like uh, uh, they're not playing a team that is that is that is at the bottom of the league or near the bottom of the league. Uh, their table position is so, but. Uh, Last seven games, and the last seven games, it's not. We are not talking about week or two weeks. We are talking about six weeks or whatever. Uh, they are, they are on the second spot. They are number two. We are number one. They are number two. So tomorrow we are playing a team that is in really good form. It's full of confidence. That uh, that won four games out of seven. And as I said, if there was a table for last seven games, they would be right behind us. Uh, so, very, very difficult one. At the same time, we are the first. Even in those seven games, we are playing home, we are in a good mood, so... Uh, that doesn't change the plan, what we want to do. I'm only saying that uh, we have to, everybody, including the fans, everybody that is connected to West Brom, has to approach that game in an extremely serious way. And it is, to be fair, it is. Heading into the game, Slaven, is there any team news, any any fitness worries that you've got? No, so far so good. Uh, we trained yesterday. The guys who played against Preston, they have done a bit of training. The guys who didn't, they done more. So to, they were going to be all together. And uh, but uh, no, no any more issues. Uh, the guys are coming back. To be fair, still there are couple of them who are out, but uh, from the department in, in that area we have a, we are we're in a good situation and we have uh, solutions, we have options and we have the guys who are informed. How good is it to have a strong bench as well and a strong squad in a week one. where you have three it's games? It's crucial one, not only when, not only when, when the people are talking about the squad uh, especially when uh, around that Christmas period when you have games and games and games and games, but it's important all the time, not only for a team selection but for the competition and the trainings. For uh, they are the best way is when they push each other, and that is what is happening here. So the guys are confident, but the guys are also hungry, and they the guys know they have to deliver week in week out, game in game out, training in training out to keep the spot, but at the same time being not afraid of, of taking risks uh, when, when it's needed and express themselves. Just finally, Slavin, just want to ask about the latest on Kieran Gibbs and Grady Diangana. How are those two? Kieran is good. He's training with us uh, for almost a couple of weeks now. Uh, what he missed was that one game. He, he played one game for 420 freeze but it was very snowy if you remember that game uh, but he's back he's, uh, he's looking good in trainings uh, Grady is uh, he's on a pitch he's not training with us but he's on a pitch doing uh, that individual stuff that is in between rehabilitation and and uh, join the first team uh, he's quite quite close to come back to uh, start training with us